What's going on, boys and girls? Extreme Duck 83 here, bringing you my scoreboard stuff. Um, sorry guys, I did not make a video yesterday. I was really wanting to, but I really wanted to work on my scoreboard here. As you can see, it has some changes. It has both sides, and this works. Uh, also, I hooked up the levers. So, say this is crappy, right? You go in here. The judge only can go in here. He'll flip to there. He'll turn off this one. And go to, let's just give him a four. Come out here. And it's a four. So now this turns off and that goes there. Then we go here. I'm just going to show you this. Do -do -do. Flip it over here. Turn this off. Come over here. Let's give my creation a nine. Now guys, everything you see here is my own idea. The only thing out of all of the ideas that I will be having is like the budge switches and that's it. But everything else I'm learning from scratch, not from YouTube, not from Google, but all from how I find works. So see it works here. Now guys, uh, I was a little bit busy yesterday so I didn't make a video. As you can see, there's the normal thing I showed yesterday which is a lot. Within four hours, I was working on this. So this is the reason. Also, hooked them up to the levers. I did not make a video because I really wanted to get this made, and I didn't feel like it was a great thing to do if I did not have this done because I really wanted to show. So I did that. Also, guys, I've been asked to build a hockey arena for the Ucom and I build, and I'm going to do that next. I know I said I was going to do the cave, but I've already done something that was the mine shaft with the cave, and I kind of want to try doing something different with the U comments. So the hockey arena really helps. The guy that asked me to do it, he's also going to help, and I got two other friends that are going to help, and they're going to be playing with me once we get a set. So what this is here is the scoreboard. Right here we have it still on working. So what this does is how this works oh, I'm not I'll do a tutorial like next week but how this actually works is you can see the lever right now that's on it goes through here goes here goes all the way here goes here goes here and then goes here now how this one works is it sends a pulse rate to there and it goes in more after you'll see what I mean but what I did is I placed it so that the pulse sends here so the way this is set up it hits all those there's seven of those three digital three I mean the three on the eight digital I read like three one two three uh, lit up by one of these so it's made that this lights it all up so when that lever is pulled it sends a pulse down here that lights up those which lights up all the ones which makes the number now the thing I had a problem with is making all the other ones not light up too so as you can see right here this sends here goes up but because all the these to go in are faced like this it can't do it so it can't screw it all up so guys I'm going to do a tutorial on how this all works and up here just like to show you this is what I was working on yesterday getting it up here and also the pistons which these what these pistons do is it switches from this side to this side and this is made done very easily with where is it this this is all it is so when this is on when this is on all we got here is that this is off so this is on this is off when this lever is off this is on so these will be powered when they're on which will shut off this which will stop all light from showing there but when it is switched but also and when the light is here let's just show you here this light is on because these pistons are not powered so when you switch the switch what it does is it switches sides now this just made it a lot easier so I didn't have to create two things which I'm going to have to do though in the hockey arena and I will be so you can go to here like that and it switches it works whole hundred percent uh, this is in two days of working on this uh, I've known no, none of these 
um, strategies, none of these ways to build at all. No clue how, how to build any of these before this, so this is all experience of two days work. So, yeah, that was what I was working on yesterday, that part, and that's come to the thing that I just started on working today. Now, as I'm starting a hockey one, don't know why that is there, but as I'm doing a hockey one, you need periods, right? And I'm like, crap, this is going to be really hard. But again, I use my mind and try to find a way to make, when I start, it will actually start a timer. So I'll have a timer besi uh, beside it here, which will say time, and I'll make that work five seconds too. But right now, I got periods, so you start this. When you start this period, it actually starts the whole game, which I'm thinking will dispense a villager above so that it starts the game. And there'll be a referee, so don't worry. Or there should be. So you press the one. Want you press it once. It switches one. Press it twice. Switches. Let's see here. Hold on. Um. It'll switch. Oh, sorry. I forgot something. As I've made all these, I'm still making. I'm sorry about that. Forgot to test it before I made this video. Do 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 do. That works. And now watch. That makes a two. Both of these I will make a tutorial probably in the week because I have to build it as then I'll speed up the time. But it will still be me building it, which will be really hard. So let's flip it again. Goes to three. Isn't that sick? Now there's three periods, so that's all you need. You press the rest reset button. After that happens. Now I was thinking of making the clock connected to this, but the problem was what if you want a two minute break, because there are uh, intermissions, and I'm like, yeah, so you press it yourself, so press it, starts, drops puck, which is a villager, then once it goes, I'll actually have also alarm hooked up so that when the five minutes is up, it go beep, and stuff, <laughs> so yeah. I am a little bit new at, like, I've only, I actually bought Minecraft December the 2nd, only played it two weeks before on single player, and just started using Redstone, actually, two, I actually got taught kind of the basics about Redstone two days uh, before I made the elevator video, if you want to check that out, so this is a little bit more complex, so we're just going to also go at the nets because I built something that will work for the nets and this was MC edited I am a server um, so this I'm just trying to fool around check with because I don't want to touch this too much so right now here we are guys I have nets so thinking of what net this one I was thinking hey it looks good the only problem is yeah there if you're skating and then that one doesn't really work so guys vote on what net you want me to build there's this one I don't really like it but it's up to you so you go like this and you hit a villager in and yeah we so yeah you have to hit it in that's how the hockey's gonna work and you're gonna use sticks so then there's this one which doesn't have the pit, the, the the pressure plates but I, I'll add it in this is just for design the way it looks so there's this the way it looks like that there's this the way it looks like that there's this one the way it looks like that and there's my favorite one not because it looks like that also I'm gonna do gold um because it goes like that I like this one because it's three wide and it works so what one do you think for uh if you guys think this this is number one so if you guys think number one is the best then please leave it in a comment if you think number two here is the best leave it in a comment number three number four and awesome number five also just so you guys can see I've just started I've never done this before so I just started this so I'm a beginner just like a lot of people but uh, I just heard this today and I started working on the light scheme so watch <laughs> see you can tell when you score and the thing is thing I like about this is you can stay on it and it will go off because of the way the piston is so guys hope you enjoyed this video so I didn't get one out yesterday I'll probably be posting a parkour map today or tomorrow because my friends are building some as we speak hope you guys enjoy thank you for being an awesome audience and subscribe and like if you enjoy this and 
Yeah, I think I I think I'm pretty good with redstone. I am still a beginner, but I built this in three days. So, if you guys want more redstone uh, contraptions, please leave a comment below on what you'd want. I'm going to be working on a hockey arena, really good one too. Also, this is this is the color I think I think redstone should be gold. I mean, no. ah, again with this stupid thing, butter, butter. See, butter, butter. Butter, butter. That was awkward. Okay, so guys, thanks for viewing, and guys, hope you guys have a great day. And I will be be posting the tour, the tour, the tutorial very uh, soon in the next week, guys. Hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to check out our build number one and build number two. Build number three is coming up very soon. Hope you guys enjoy. Have a wonderful day. Thanks, guys, for watching. Bye.